It's Art Around the World Week, and today we're going to be making 3D turtles using recycled materials. Turtles are in just about every continent in the world except for Antarctica, so that's pretty cool. Our turtle today is going to be using a piece of a cardboard egg carton. You cut out one of the little cups that the eggs go in. Um, it's going to be using a piece of color paper. If you don't have color paper, just use white printer paper and we can add color to it in another way. We're going to be using eye stickers or Google Eyes. If you don't have either one of those, we're going to be using a white piece of paper, drawing the eyes, and we can cut those out later. And then we're also going to be using watercolor paints so or any kind of paint that you have will actually work so um, the first thing you're going to want to do to make your turtle is to cut out one of the little cups of um, an egg carton a cardboard egg carton to use and then your next step is going to be to paint that using whatever kind of paint you have and then let it dry Okay. Let it dry till it's really good and dry so that it doesn't get um, on everything when you're trying to work for the rest of your turtle. Then we're going to take our piece of colored paper or a piece of printed paper and we're going to draw out our basic turtle. Um, you can use pencil first, because, um, but I'm going to be using a marker so that you can see what I'm doing. Okay. So um, it doesn't have to be the whole piece of paper. Matter of fact, it's better if it's not. I'm going to fold mine in half just so you can see that it only is going to take up about a quarter of our piece of paper, okay? So, um, why don't we fold it again so that it can be a good size for the egg carton which we're going to be using for our shell. Okay, so then what we're going to do right here up at the top is we're going to draw a half of an oval like that. Okay. And um, before we start drawing the actual turtle, what we should do is the carton, egg carton shell that we're going to use, you're going to put it in the middle of your paper and you're just going to trace around that with your pencil so you can know where you're going to put that and where other things should be. Okay. And then once you're done tracing it, you're going to know that the head's going to go right up here like we just drew. Then we're going to draw the four turtle legs going out. One two, three, and then four. And then I might want to add some turtle toes just to all of my legs. That'll be fun to do. And then I'm going to want to think about the eyes. What do I want to do for the eyes? Okay. So, um, if you have eye stickers, like Mrs. Unused stickers, you can use those. If you have Google Eyes, you can certainly use those. But you're going to want to put your turtle's eyes up here, kind of towards the, where the shell might be. Okay, up near the top. All right. Then we're going to want to draw the turtle's nose right here at the end of the head part that we drew. Okay. And then we want to make sure we add a turtle tail back here. Okay, then we're going to cut out this part, okay? Um, mine's going to give me probably four of these because I folded it into four, but you just need to cut out one, okay? I like to turn my paper, it just makes it easier for me to cut. Um, and when I get to the part, that shell part that we traced, I'm gonna just kind of scoot around it like that, okay? You can bubble cut if you don't want to um, practice your cutting today. It is possible to bubble cut it, um, meaning pretending that the turtle is in a bubble and you're just gonna cut around instead of cutting exactly on the lines. Okay, so then when we are done and we have the turtle all cut out like that, you are ready you take that dried painted shell and you're going to um, put some glue around it and glue it on, okay? Um, I'm just turning it around to see the best fit, how will it look best on my turtle. Um, I'm going to be using tacky glue just because it dries super fast, but you could use hot melt glue, you could use, um, if mom or dad are ready to help you, 
or you could use um, regular Elmer's glue, okay? And you're gonna wanna put that down how you decided you were gonna put it down. And then I hold on to it for just a little bit um, and count until that turtle has its shell so that it's staying on and you're all done. So have fun making turtles.